at this occasion to inaugurate the first community-based eye hospital in the state, donated by elder statesman and Nigeria's former chief of army staff, General Theophilus Danjuma, retired. The national coordinator of the National Eye Health Program laments that vision loss accounts for the annual loss of $411 billion globally in economic productivity. She states that the elimination of blindness is key to the achievement of the Sustainable Development Goals of Nigeria. Zero hunger, general health and well-being, quality education, gender equity, decent work and economic growth. Indeed, good vision is that golden thread that runs through the Sustainable Development Goals. Therefore, we at the Federal Ministry of Health are delighted about this this um, great project. Retired General Theophilus Danjuma, in his speech, insists that Nigeria as a country must be peaceful with trained manpower and job opportunities to checkmate those traveling abroad for greener pastures. People look up to us. But right now, we are not behaving as leaders of the world. As a nation, we must change. It is time for us to change. But I can assure you that we have peace. If we have peace, and we must have peace in this state and in the country, in the next few years, Takum will be a different place. For Governor Abu Kefas, the philanthropic gesture of retired General T.Y. Danjuma will complement the efforts of government in providing accessible and affordable health care services, especially in local communities. He appeals to the organized private sector to emulate the elder statesman. General Danjuma's example serves as a reminder that each of us has the power to make a difference and that by working together we can create a better future for all. Residents of this community and adjoining communities are optimistic that the existence of this eye hospital will reduce the vulnerability of residents to some of the eye-related ailments predominant in the area.